What happens to bricks and concrete when they're left in the ocean? Well, it naturalizes it, of course. It turns it into a beautiful rock. The waves, the sand, even the sea snails cut it down. These periwinkle sea snails, these are actually very abrasive as they climb across the rocks. It's also a really good idea never to touch a sea snail. Now this one's not particularly dangerous, but there are seashells out there that are as venomous as rattlesnakes. Seashells may look fun and beautiful, but they can be deadly. And if you touch a seashell, you want to make sure that you clean your hands. There can be all kinds of parasites and diseases. With that out of the way, let's get back to the concrete and bricks. Didn't the ocean do a beautiful job carving this thing down? What a neat design, almost like a fossil. It blends in with the rest of the rocks. It's just cool to see nature at work. There's all kinds of treasures on the beach. I found this concrete and these bricks kind of cool to see what the ocean did to it. I've never seen bricks and concrete so beautiful, so natural.